Hello everyone, and today we are back on this highway. So that means that it's time for a new technical experiment. So what have I done for you today? We have here two cars that are exactly the same, but on this one I put the smallest wheels possible, and on this one I put the biggest wheels possible. In all other respects these cars are absolute clones. And today we will see how much the acceleration of your car to 100 km per hour and the maximum speed depends on the size of your wheels. So what is the basis of this experiment? Let's introduce a new heading Explanation Imagine that this is our small wheel and this its radius. This is a small r, not z. So this is our big wheel with the radius r big. And if we calculate the length of the circles of these wheels, we get that the length of the big wheel is greater than the smaller one exactly as much as r big is bigger than r small. And that's what I'm talking about. If we take an engine, this is engine, just imagine it, and take the number of revolutions at which it works and multiply it by the length of the wheel, which in turn depends on the radius, we get that the car with a larger wheel will go with a correspondingly higher speed as many times as its radius larger. Pretty simple, isn't it? And now let's test it in practice. And here are the results. I thought that the ESC would change the result somehow, but it didn't. But we can still see that the car with the bigger wheels showed a little bit better results. The top speed has changed by as much as 8 km per hour, which I think is quite a lot, considering that the we haven't changed anything else in the car. Well, 
that's all for now. Thank you very much for watching. I will be very grateful to you for your like and subscription. See you soon. Yo, what the heck is this? Is it a Minecraft car? I think it's a revolution in the car safety industry.